Hi, I'm Mike Connolly, Superintendent of District 21, and I want to wish everybody a Happy New Year and welcome back to our winter uh, at District 21. We're really, really happy to have all of our, our students back with us and looking forward to the second half of our school year. Now, now we are in winter, um, obviously we are always on weather watch. Uh, for any of the winter storms that may come through the area. And so I just briefly wanted to um, remind parents um, that we are always tracking the weather and we do our best uh, to try and, and predict uh, what conditions are going to be uh, both while coming to school and while going home from school. Uh, sometimes uh, it's more clear cut than others. And so uh, we appreciate your understanding and your patience um, as we try and understand what weather conditions are, are going to be. Uh, and we really try to make the best call that is going to be uh, the safest for everyone. Now, as parents, um, if you determine that conditions are too hazardous uh, to send your student to school, even if our school, schools are open, that is your decision. But obviously, if schools are open, we encourage attendance as every day of school is important to be in attendance for. But um, just a little bit of a preview for uh, the second week of January, we are looking at some weather that, that uh, is gonna get pretty cold. Um, so uh, please, particularly for some of our older students that like to leave their homes uh, with hoodies, um, let's just uh, make sure that all of our students are coming um, with the, the kind of weather protection, temperature protection that is going to keep them warm um, as they are coming to and from school. We appreciate that. Uh, we are looking very much forward to February 1st, opening up uh, our annual new student and kindergarten registration. Um, there is information on the website that outlines um, the different types of information that, that parents need to bring uh, to establish residency and to, to complete the registration process. Uh, if you have neighbors or family members that reside in the district that will be new to District 21, including with kindergarten students, um, please encourage them uh, to take advantage of, of the registration beginning on, on February 1st. Uh, the sooner we have new students registered, and, and particularly our kindergarten grade level, uh, is the, ease, the, the faster we are able to make staffing decisions for how many sections of kindergarten we'll need at a specific school. Um, so uh, the, the, the sooner we can kind of get a good accounting of, of how many kindergartners are coming our way in particular, um, the better. So we appreciate you passing that information along to any neighbors or family members. Uh, earlier uh, in the week, we posted the 2024-2025 school calendar. Uh, the Board of Education approved that calendar at their December board meeting. Now, we are going to be starting a little later uh, than we normally do. Our first day of, of student attendance will be uh, Wednesday, August 28th. Now, the reason um, that we're going to be starting a little bit later is because of the amount of construction work that's going to be done in, in, in several of our buildings um, this summer. Um, obviously, we have been doing a lot of, of construction projects over the last six years. Um, this summer is going to uh, be no different. Uh, we're really looking forward to the scope of work that we're doing, which will include finishing um, the rest of our school libraries that have not, four school libraries that have not yet uh, been renovated. Uh, we're going to be uh, replacing playgrounds at some of our elementary schools, replacing bathrooms at other elementary schools, um, uh, updating classroom furniture across the district. Um, so lots going on, and we really just want to make sure that in a really, really short uh, summer construction season that we are able to provide an, enough time um, for our contractors to be able to complete their quality work and make sure that our schools are, are um, ready, clean, and safe for students to come back. So again, we apologize for any inconvenience um, for starting the school year a little bit later next year, um, but we're doing that to try and make sure that all of our facilities are, are ready to go um, and we're really proud of the work that we've been doing to upgrade our school facilities over the past several years. In December of, um, at, the, at their board meeting, we're really happy to announce that the Board of Education named the district's um, new Director of Early Childhood Education, uh, Melissa Scarletta. Uh, Melissa has been a teacher in District 21. She's currently a coordinator for student services, and she will be taking over uh, the role of Director of Early Childhood Education um, when our current director, Lynn Duffy, retires at the end of this school year. So congratulations to Melissa, and we're really looking forward to having you in that role. 
Finally, um, I just want to wish everybody a really, really happy and safe January. Uh, as we're starting off the new year, uh, I hope, wish you success for any New Year's resolutions that, that you and your family may have established. Uh, and just hope that you stay safe and warm. And obviously, as, as um, we deal with winter weather, um, we'll keep in communication uh, as much as we can with you uh, so that we can all make effective decisions um, for uh, student attendance. So thank you.